Yo, Reggae Media TV, Bada Dan, everything we bad, and we mad at Dan, everything we mad. Skadesh, what one all my viewers, all my subscribers, bless up on yourself, hope y'all you doing well. So right there, my father bigging up Vibes Cartel along with his son who are facing a similar situation right now. Love to get to you for them achievement. Yeah, yeah. Don't fight it, you happy for them. No, no, no. Alright, I hope them don't come with this thing now, say, my father, a big friend from Vibes Cartel. The other day, I see TJ go big up Alkaline Pan stage. <laughs> it's like the fans them start say, yo, TJ a big friend from Alkaline. TJ have to come out with a video. Well, mad. I say, I'm not a big enough friend from nobody. But you know, we have to end us the unity more time when we see it go on in a dance hall because dance hall really need that. Okay, so the next thing I'm gonna talk about is Beanie Man's daughter, Ashley Jade Davis. Yes, people, coming out saying that she is bi. So basically, she got both ways. She is just 25 years old, and this really shocking to a lot of fans. And recently, after seeing she come out on IG with the caption right here saying, For those of you who were not aware, I'm bi. I realized. I was a little different from the typical Jamaican girl Pitney when I couldn't wait to head to the locker rooms just so I could watch the girls change. It's something I had to hide around my family and some friends as well. Today I embrace who I am. I wouldn't change a thing. Yeah people so you know what that kind of month there and it's like she just come out and uh, speak out. It's like. For this coming from Beanie Man Data, it is shocking to a lot of fans. Well, so far, a lot of people don't really know about Ashley Jade Davis. Well, she kinda resemble Beanie Man next data, Disha Rivers still. Me not gonna lie, so don't get it twisted. Although some people always speculate about Disha Rivers based on how she dress and them things there. But right now, it's like Ashley J. Davis, she not afraid to come out anymore and speak. But it kind of ironic to see this a come from a daughter of an artist who was an outspoken anti when it come on to them things there during the peak of his career in the mid 90s. So even in the 2002, you know them type of slang that them kind them kind of song there, bun this bun that. Yes, yeah, so I know say it's surprising to a lot of fans out there based on the comments I'm seeing, you know. But people, what y'all think about this right here coming from Ashley Jade Davis? So people know TJ outfit at the BT Awards have him fans them I wonder what one with him. So right here is like some of the fans them are criticize TJ as you can see some of the comments right here. This person say clean clothes, madman. A next person right here comment and say, You are my artist, you know, but where the F you get this green pants from? Mm -hmm. A next person say, What a choice of colors. LOL, big up yourself still. Mm -hmm. So it's like this way TJ go here, have the fans them attack. A next person right here say, 
Janua, I hope the DJ alright feel like he go through something. Yeah, so people are going to feel like that. Worse, them see TJ come out the hospital the other day. So, it's like <laughs> the, the dressing right here is like some of the fans them believe that it was off. And you know what, dressing a one thing we bring off an artist, you know. Yeah. No, f- no, for them might take it light and thing underestimate it. But me, I tell you, dressing a one thing, and not just music alone. Your fashion have to speak for itself. Okay, so people, you know, say me did a reason with somebody the other day, and it's like it come to me and I say, you know, say it's an album pop kind of work, and why I'm not really dip on the scene? Because here, what you see, the first time. The last time I see him with Popcorn did come off of the scene and then boom we hear say Popcorn have an album dep on the way. So it's like right about now. Some of Popcorn fans, even though them concerned, some of them I wonder where Popcorn they because them not used to Popcorn doing this for so long. You see me? Yeah, I see him we like the last time when Popcorn I worked on him album, we did we never really see Popcorn on the scene and I think it happened before. So it's like Popcorn one thing with him. From him tell himself say he ma go work on a project. Me not talk about no EP or anything. Me not talk about album. You see me like where we come from and them type of project there, them big project there. So it's like right now Popcorn maybe he ma prefer make a bigger album than the last time because you notice each time Popcorn go for work on an album it improve. You know, he did go number one. For a longer time, you know, it sell more and them things there. It go up the chart more each time Popcorn drop an album. It improve. So now it's like Popcorn. I feel like he ma put in some serious work because whenever Popcorn decide that he ma go do an album, you know, the man well focus. Him not really take no time off or nothing like that. So it's like at that Popcorn I work pan man. Not not really do popcorn, <laughs> yeah, people. Because if you notice him, just jump off the scene suddenly, just like that. Okay, so the next video me a feature, you know, L.A. Lewis recently got lock up him. Come out now still, but it's like Golly Bop I exposed something out there. Me don't know if we Golly Bop are talk about a choose still, but you know them always I go back and forth, back and forth. So check this out, what Golly Bop I exposed out there in the media. I forgot to tell you this too. Now fast in everybody business, I'm gonna I'm gonna fast in a certain business. Here we are going. On no sudden lock up LA Lewis at Spanish town for thief fall foot. <laughs> Go in a supermarket at thief chicken foot. And come from big Facebook and, and, and Instagram. I can talk about say I told him say the people don't have to take no vaccine. Not no go so. Hold him in a hell of supermarket over at Spanish town at thief fall foot. Lock him up, big disgrace. Can't believe seven star got teeth fall foot. A Spanish town and lock up in blood climbers. Boy, my call people for bail him. Yeah. Teeth fall foot. I mean, I'm telling you, I'm going to Jamaica. I'm going to tell you all the way I'm going, you know. Oh. With the blogger, they're going to Jamaica. Ashanti 360 and, and, and LA Lewis. All Ashanti 360, in pop down so till I sell apple and papa out of Mountain View. I sell papa up and cat. And apple. Uh-huh. And grape. You want to see him there the house up and cat. Big blog up on blood club, Facebook, a usual style of holy papi. For people, you must sell orange and ripe banana. Papa and then cane and then king. There. Alright, now cane hardly sell, because people don't have teeth again for me and them fuckery. So if you sell cane juice, we sell. I, I, I have, you have a clean meal when milk cane. All I'm going to offer to you is sell cane juice. The whole of Jamaica buy it from him in cranny. Run a yard plaza, this, uh, the man cranny. Why do you tell the man tell me a cane juice? I tell me looking at the man sitting and yell. I say, you know, I have no change, I soon come. Yeah, tell the taxi man, cut. Yeah, you know, wash out on a stinking thing and yell before you know, come on road come sell people. Oh. And I found a girl. We are going like on a hot girl road and fish about her and I want a molly arm. Oh. Because I rub roll on and I eat when you roll on, cake up and I don't know if you use roll on. I don't know if you wipe a little and I don't know how I use it and I don't know if you rub it up. 
Yeah, I make you hear out. Yeah.